Mabuhay everyone, Mark Chess here and I'm back for some updates, store updates actually from Nike Park over at Glorieta or I think it's all over Nike Park or the Nike stores nationwide here in the Philippines. So I will be just giving you some new stuff that I saw over at Nike Park. So first up is the new colorway of the LeBron 16 Lowe's. It's an army green camo colorway and it's still priced at 8095 I think this colorway is really dope compared to the first one. The soundtrack colorway which I didn't like that much. But this one actually looks cool. So another new shoes that I saw is the Mamba Focus. This is the new budget model for the Kobe line. This is the Mamba Focus. It's priced at 5,000 pesos. It's on the budget side of things. And they had the black and white. They also have the white upper with the gum bottom. I think this gum bottom looks pretty sick. I want to try it out. Maybe I'll get the white one because it has a gum bottom. I hope it has a nice traction. The tech in the Mamba Focus is a rectangular zoom unit which is not that big in the forefoot. I'll try to test them out for you guys. I'm just fixing my budget. Hang in there. And another budget model that I want to try is the LeBron Witness 3. Uh, they had the bread colorway with the black upper which looks really nice. It really looks like the Jordan 11 bread colorway. The LeBron Witness 3 also has the Concord colorway, the Jordan 11 Concord colorway, which is really nice. I'm thinking of buying one too. Then the tech for the LeBron Witness 3, it has full length air, not zoom but air, similar to the Jordan 11s. And the LeBron Witness is priced at 5,500 pesos, so not that bad. And the Mamba Focus is 5,000. I think if you're looking for tech, the, maybe the Witness 3 is the way to go is just 500 more pesos with a better cushion. I have to try them out first and see how they perform. Also what's out is the Jordan Cargo which I think is very good for lifestyle and it looks really nice. And it's priced at 6745 It has the cream off-white color and the, the black and white outsole colorway. And another new retro from Jordans is the Jordan 13. It's a gray and white colorway. For the Jordan Why Not 0.2, they have a new colorway, the all white, triple white colorway. It's really purely white and it looks very, very clean. I don't know if I can rock these on court because I know it will easily get dirty. And also another one that came out is the Jordan 1 Lowe's with a gum outsole but the traction is pink, which looks really nice, but I have to pass on it because I just bought the Phantom. So, pass muna sa Jordans. I, actually, I'm waiting for the Jordan SB Dunk Collab, which has an updated cushion. It has a zoom unit in the heel. So, I think it will be more comfortable to wear that for walking lifestyle. Also, there's a mid colorway. I think it, this came out two weeks ago. And it has a white cream and pink laces. And the Lakers colorway with the yellow upper, black swoosh, and a white outsole. And what else did I see there? And a couple of Jordan Reacts which has the white colorway and, and the tan colorway and the black colorway. And I tried it in store and it's really comfy. It's like you're wearing the Epic React with a different upper. So if you want a different model with the React cushioning, I think this shoe is the way to go. So that's it on my shortstop over at Nike Park Lorietta. Do check out the store if you're near the area. If you're in BGC, they have more options there more choices because it's a bigger store so this has been Mark Chess once again thank you for watching this video and I'll catch you in the next one peace